Boom, boom. Right. Let's settle into this and see if we can get a cleaner run with better Cyclops bits and hopefully just fewer mistakes in general. I'm not optimistic. <laughs> Okay, interesting spot to start. There's a lot of salvage around, which is kind of nice, because I'll grab one of those. Grab this limestone, get quartz in here, get double quartz, so I need one more limestone. Wow. Wow, game. Okay, thankfully there's a couple here. But that's very rude. <laughs> Would it be nice if it was two copper, actually? Okay, well, we have a lot of silvage, which is kind of nice. I don't normally want it all right now, but... Right, let's go over this way first, just in case we see any lucky sea glides. So then we can skip the wreck if we do. Oh, let's go faster than I realize. Okay, so that's three quarts. Four quarts. One and four. Two and four. Three and four. Perfect. Four and four. Four and five. Decent. Four and five. Mobile vehicle bay. We will actually scan now anyway. Four and five. Two mobile vehicle bay. I'm not sure if I want to scan this one though, but I might as well. It's like wasting time now to gain time later. Would have been nice if they were sea glides, but... Two and five. That's a sea glide though. That's a mobile vehicle bay, I think. Nope, this is also a mobile vehicle bay. Darn. Okay, I would have really, really, really loved some sea glides here. Those are both good metal. I didn't notice if there was contraband around here. They are putting in some work, so that's good. No sea glides though. Alright, well. We have the long swim. This is where it would have been better if we'd done like remote storage, and then we could just take a death here after scanning things. Uh, that's if I get any. Okay. We do have two. We've got one there and one all the way over there. It's a long way, but... It'll have to do... Then we can pick up some salvage as we go. Ah, oh, that's right, the collision is weird there. You can't scan through that other thing. Alright. slow but we've got what we needed and we already have mobile vehicle bay which is nice i mean i shouldn't have bothered because i know i'm going to be back there later <laughs> well probably maybe not i'll usually be back there later and i'll be like waiting for teeth later so could have been scanning while waiting it's just too inviting Right, let's make the bare minimum, and then we can make the extra battery already, that's good. So we're at four. Four out of nine. Lubricant is essential. So we're at four and five. Or five and four, if you prefer. Five and four. Six. Six and five. Seven and five. Eight and five. Nine and five. Nine and six. Ten and six. Ten and six. I'm gonna come down here for that. It's a little bit out of the way, but it is nice to just get 
two, three, four, so ten and six. Seven, eleven and seven. Wow, there's a lot in here. Twelve and seven. Twelve and eight. Nine. Cool. Feels weird leaving so many resources in here, but we don't need them right now. Computer chip, wiring kit, and habitat builder, and grab as much of this as we can out. Put those away, grab those instead. So we just need to know that we need to keep lead later. Okay, base with a hatch and a handful of solar panels on top. Power restored. All primary systems online. One, two, and three. And then we grab those and let's make fabricator. Hop down the ghost of another fabricator, make that leave, hop down here, I find I often need to drop another couple of mushrooms, there's the flood, a little bit late, we were a little bit slow earlier, we can grab that now, make our wall locker, we can make our end locker, and we can do that, alright, Shouldn't have picked that one up, it's too close to bother. Never mind. I want three salvage. Sure, there we go. One. Um, like four copper. Two. Three. Cool. And one. Two. Where's the other ones? Three, four, a couple more quartz. Are we now full already? Okay. Ah, oh, I got three of those, that's why. Okay. Oh, I have all of this stuff on me. I didn't actually put stuff away. I'm a fool. Okay. Never mind. Uh, okay, so five. One more copper, ideally. Oh, that's fine. Let's get oxygen. Leading to an unknown environmental bio. Down here and inside here, immediately start scanning the multi purpose room. Be careful you don't break the scan, or you have to start again, and we will die. You can also grab a bladderfish at this point to have made it more safe down here, but I didn't think of it, so that means we're out of here. Once we get above 100, then it's a little bit safer. There we go, now we go south. I don't need to look for mobile vehicle bay at least, so that saves a little bit of time on the way back. That's kind of nice. Uh, down here. Nope, too far across. Okay, well, I haven't wasted too much oxygen yet. Down here. We need a single gel sack and a single ruby. There's a gel sack. Ruby's usually over here by the thermal vent. There, good. I uh, also need another couple of quartz still, so let's grab those. I would also like another copper. Good. 
I think I also still need another few silver. But I can get them from the geyser if I really want to. So I'm not that far from there. I also need teeth, but I'll try and get them from the usual spot later. I want to get them during the daytime usually. Just pick up some more salvage since it's on the way. Why not? I think I have all the copper I need. Oh, inventory full. Alright, so. Fiber mesh. Finish that one off. Fiber mesh. Titanium. Pick up the flare. Glass. Glass. And glass. Uh, take off this and upgrade our tank. I'll uh, need the silver for that. Upgrade our tank. Grab out these. Battery, battery, aerogel, salvage, salvage. Do we have a. Wait. Oh, yeah, we do have that. Good. Copper wire. There we go. Because then we want to make one of these. Nice big multi purpose room. And we want to make a hatch on that. And we want to make our filtration machine. Get that going now. We've still got a decent amount of power in our base. Down here, and get some sea glide back, hopefully. Uh, do that. Uh, we don't have enough. Hmm, see, so yeah, we need two more silver so that we can get that rebreather, because that's quite important at this point. Alright, so. Uh, just geyser. Easiest place to go for this stuff right now. So we're fine on everything else, but we do need our full complement here. I also will need one more silver as well, but that's all right. Cool. Now we can do that, and then we can be ready for this. Good. That is now everything we need. We actually have too much uh, lead. That's fine. Okay. Flare storage on the wall locker and head off around this direction. We're not going to get teeth yet because it's night time and that's miserable. I mean it's bad enough going across the red grass at night but there's this kind of bioluminescence about the place so that's fine. Two... Three... Four... Five... Six, seven, eight, nine. Whereas the fish tend to be a bit dopey at day at night time sometimes. Ten. Scan the guaranteed sea moth. We need two more ideally. Eleven. Twelve. 13, I hope my count is correct, 14, 15, maybe we get a couple of extra if we need to, 16, 17, that's bioreactor, you know what, let's scan the bioreactor just to get rid of it, it just gets rid of it out of the pool, so 16, there's Seamoth anyway, that's good. Seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, twenty-one, twenty-two. Time capsule. I can't get. I can't get rid of it. Okay, stalker teeth. All right, I'll take that. Thank you. That simplifies things a lot. 
<laughs> it was going to be either that or actually just getting water. 21, 22, 23. I have no idea if this is the correct count now. 24, 25, 26. We just go to where we're full. 27, 28, 29. And we're full, so we go up. I think we might be short, but. Oh no, we actually got one too many. And we got six Sorker's Teeth. That's funny. That's actually annoying because it's going to throw my uh, inventory off at this point. Eh. Uh, funny. Now that is why we don't allow time capsules in the real run. <laughs> but they are legit in bingo. So I will take that. It probably won't matter, but that's the silver that I need. Uh, lithium, good. So that's one lithium. I thought that was a shale. Shale is so hard to spot on these walls without being on an angle. We need a scanner rock grub as well. So we've got one lithium. Come on, game. Give me the shale, not just rubies and quartz. There we go. One diamond. Two lithium. Three lithium. Another time capsule. You know what? Fine. Maybe we get something else we want. Nope. Ah, no. Don't drop the teeth. Idiot. <laughs> Two. Oh, that's the thing. Three. There we go. Whew. Got overzealous with dropping things. Okay, rock grub. That's what we're re <coughs> really here for. Okay, and then need more shale. I can get shale elsewhere. So what else did we pick up? I can get rid of that. So we're at five. Five lithium. So I just need one more lithium. There we go. And then one more diamond, so it has to come from shale. Well, we're not getting it here. Where's my life pod beacon? Oh, there's the island. Okay. Completely lost my sense of direction there. Here's the wreck. Is shale sometimes on these sorts of outcroppings around here? Hull. It's magnetite. That's annoying. I didn't realize it could be magnetite as well. Okay, well, screw me then, I guess. We'll have to get it some other way. Uh, hull. And hull. Good. So that's a start. Now I just need bridge. Shale. Ah, I need diamond. But at least I know it's loose. Oh good. This means I can now deconstruct the wreck. Which might make that a little bit easier. It's just easier to see things now. Uh, hull, hull, one bridge. But only the one there. Two. Oh, hull. Alright, we need one more bridge. Which means we have to go hunting for it. Let's go to like the usual spots first, so like through here. Shale? I thought I saw shale. Okay, well, I guess we're not getting bridge. Cool, thanks, game. Here it is. Okay. Yeah, we're almost dead, but we got for oxygen. And then we get 
blood oil and hopefully shale. Also, let's just swap batteries while I'm here. Should be plenty. So we go down here. You can get shale on the walls of the Lost River. Not Lost River. Um, blood Cult Trench. But it's usually rubies and stuff instead. It's basically like the sparse reef. Uh, I'm not seeing any shale. Well, whatever. Uh, one of those. Two, three of those. Is there shale in the dunes? I just need one diamond. That's annoying. Okay, well. We hope there's shale in the dunes near BKFL. Sandstone, sandstone, sandstone. We can also dip into the jelly shroom caves slightly on our way back. I think that's what we're going to have to do. That's annoying. That. And get out again. Okay. One more diamond. And one more sea moth. And some more salvage, probably. At least we don't have to worry about teeth. Irony being that there's probably a ton of teeth already there. Okay. This was too close. So oh, I already have Seamoth. Of course. Duh. <laughs> I forgot about that. Right, we need a diamond. So you have to go down here. This is punishment for my time capsule luck. And it's all magnetite. Wow, game. Wow. Wow. More magnetite. Okay. Oh, and then that's lithium. Alright. Karma for getting lucky with the time capsule. And that's gold. Okay. I do have like six lithium, right? Yeah, in fact, I've got too much lithium. I just need one diamond. The one thing we normally don't want more of. Come on, the next shale should be guaranteed diamond. Yes, good. Alright. Now I just need to find my way out of here again. Game is really trying to level it up. <laughs> the fun thing is, is that I'm going to go past where the dogs are and they're probably going to have dropped all the teeth for me. I need to pick up the metal anyway. Because I can't do it now because I'm already full. But I do need that metal. Like, that's kind of part of the plan, is going back to the dogs. I can get one, maybe two salvage, I hope. Yeah. But now I think I'm full. Yep. And I can come over here and... Alright, so there's a ton of metal there. I'm going to actually drop that. Is there contraband? No, there isn't. Okay, well, as I say, we have to come back here and grab all of that metal because we need it. That's kind of the amusing thing. Right, blood oil. Free up that inventory space. Titanium. Titanium. Uh, right, we need the fibers. That's right. So we can synthetic fibers. Ingot, sure, why not? We're going to need that. Ah, oh, and that was the titanium we needed. Oops. Okay. Uh, let's do all of... You know what? Let's just take everything out, I think, actually, at this point. I think we have the inventory space. The fact we've already got the teeth, we can just process the glass. But regardless, we would have just grabbed that out anyway. And then there's the reinforced dive suits. Uh, I don't want to make the plasteel right now. Uh, okay, no, actually, we don't want to have everything on us right now because we need to pick up all of the metal. That's right. So let's not be silly about this. So now we come back over here. We want one, two, we need like six. 
One, two. All the metals disappeared anyway. Okay, you just pick that up. Three. Four. I'm glad I got the teeth when I did because. Five. Ow. Because they're not dropping any. But I mean, you know. We've got time that we'd have been able to sit there for a bit and curate stuff. The water bottle's probably only just finished. It takes like 16 minutes, I think, when you've got full power. Okay, now we grab everything out of here. Uh, lubricant? Oh, the other thing that I was meant to get from the dogs, that's right, is two more of these. Yeah, we forgot this last time. Though, last time it was more complicated. We have everything else, I think. Almost. Almost everything else. We make that, we go in here, we pop into this, we take those out, we tick off that, we deconstruct this for the copper wire. I mean, that's kind of excessive, we don't really have to, like we could have just picked up two more copper earlier, probably. Um, oh yeah, we need to turn that into a computer chip. So we need more of that. There. Super Sea Glide, get that. Okay, and now I think we've got everything. Now we go to the underwater islands to scan the Cyclops engine. might want to deconstruct the wreck that's here just because it makes it easier to see sometimes it's not night time yet though because we've just been pretty quick not having to hang around for stalker teeth is kind of nice though I, I do honestly feel that the advantage of that was very much offset by not getting diamonds quickly <laughs> Because we should have gotten diamonds much more quickly. <laughs> Alright, and now we go up here. Release that. Don't need to worry about death, that's for sure. And we have what we need. Excellent. And we try not to die. <laughs> Last thing we want is to have the Cyclops kill us when it falls on us. Loosh. Then we come. Up we go. And it is a rare sub 30. Nice. <laughs> well, that was lucky. <laughs> Having the teeth definitely was handy. But when you consider the time it takes to actually open the time capsule, it's a slow animation, the diamonds and stuff. If you get good teeth luck, it probably works out about the same, to be honest. Cool. Well, hope you enjoyed that. Thank you very much for watching. We'll see you next time.